Hello, my name is Arlo. I'm in Kii, Texas, and I'm going to try a trick. And that is to put a live brown recluse spider and a live black widow spider simultaneously on my hand for two minutes. So, the purpose of this is to show people out there who are afraid of spiders that spiders don't necessarily just bite you out of spite. So if I'm wrong and I get some kind of hideous bite on my finger, then we'll have a nice video documentation of the necrosis and everything that happens. But I don't think it's going to go that way. So, behold, spiders on hand for two minutes. The southern black widow, Latrodectus mactans, is a member of the cobweb spider family, Theridiidae. It typically inhabits dry, shady corners, and its venom is 15 times more toxic than that of a rattlesnake. Black Widow venom contains alpha latrotoxin, a poison which causes massive stimulation of neurotransmitter release. This may cause severe, uncontrollable, and prolonged muscle contraction at the site of the bite. Victims also report spasmodic pain, intense abdominal cramps, nausea, and profuse perspiration. If untreated, the victim may become unconscious and suffocate. The brown recluse, Loxosceles reclusa, is a member of the spider family Sicariidae. It is nocturnal, has six eyes, and its bite is medically significant. Brown recluse venom contains phospholipase D and sphingomyelinase, both of which cause the lipid bilayer of animal cells to burst. It may cause kidney failure, coagulopathy, and rarely, death. The abdomen of the brown recluse also contains a cocktail of hemolytic toxins that are not delivered in the bite. Bites are rare, but typically cause necrotic skin lesions, which may heal slowly and leave a concave depression of scar tissue. Many insecticidal sprays do not kill the brown recluse, but they may cause nerve damage, maddening the spider and causing aggressive behavior. So, you've just seen me put the two most dangerous spiders in North America on my hand at the same time for two minutes, and neither of them bit me. The message here is, spiders won't bother you if you don't bother them. That said, I'm an experienced spider handler, and these are very dangerous animals, so don't try this at home.